What's good, gangs? I want to speak on some random topics. I feel that your spatial awareness and luckiness increases so much on SR, bro. I remember two weeks ago, this kid, I was playing basketball at work, and this kid asked me to if I could make a half-court shot. And I said, no, can you? And then he told me to try. I, I shot it, and it went in, bro. And last week, I was, um, somebody was guarding me. This little kid was guarding me. And I, I like, I just threw it up. And it went in at the three point line. And I, I don't even hoop, bro. <laughs> so, and I threw it up with two hands, too. So it was like more of a pass than a shot. But it's still, I just chucked it and it went in. Like, <laughs> I don't know what else to say. It's just the way the way you like are aware of um, space and your the way things move in your vicinity. It's just it increases so much more than when you're cooming, bro. Okay, uh, <laughs> random topic. This might be no no weird stuff. All right, but uh. A couple of days ago, I had some super huge urges, man, and I just felt like, like I was gonna fold, bro. Like, and, bro, my dreams have been like super vivid as of late, and like I had a, I had a wet dream where I was like, I was like with this girl, and I was just, I was trying not to fornicate with her. <laughs> But I was trying to push the line, man. So I was trying to, like... I was, like, you know, like, touching her and stuff. And then I busted, like, I was, like, <laughs> McLovin from Super Bad, dude. <laughs> and, I, and in the dream, I thought, damn, bro, like, I I relapsed, <laughs> you know? And luckily, I, uh, like, I woke up and I was like, oh, it was just a dream. But, uh, yeah, I woke up in a puddle. <laughs> like Nana says... But, um, the good thing about it, like, you know, I, I was worried that I, could, I like, lost my benefits or whatever because I, my eyes looked kind of drained, I guess, in that, that morning. But, okay, I'm not trying to be TMI, but it just felt, like, it just felt good in the sense that, like, the pressure in your genitals is just, like, in your balls, it's just, like, not, it's not, like, the pressure isn't there anymore, so, like. That was a, a <laughs> the, the one positive thing I found about uh, the wet dream, you know, since I try not to be so negative, you know. And uh, another weird thing that happened was I was at the gym and this girl, it was some weeks ago, this girl, she was a young girl, not someone I'm like particularly attracted to, but this has never happened to me before. She was just, dude. She made it so obvious, like the green light was so was clear as day, bro. She just kept staring at me from behind, like she had no shame. Bro. And when I turned around to look at her to confirm that she was still staring, she just like was cheesing really hard. And eventually, like she went upstairs to another area. Like I scanned the room, and she was like still looking at me, bro. And um, I'm not saying that to, like, brag or anything. It's just uh, something that has never happened uh, before SR. <laughs>